in this video we're going to be learning about all the things that we need to know about the data privacy officer what they do the roles and responsibilities of a data privacy officer and how much they earn and the whole works it's going to be a good one i promise hello there cyber protectors welcome to my channel i'm Toro Lopez michael your cyber security expert and career coach and the founder of excel my cyber the number one cyber security training boot camp in the u.s founded by an immigrant and today i'll be taking you on an exploration of a role that has become increasingly crucial in our data driven world the data privacy officer data privacy is one of the trendiest topics in the technology industry today and you probably know why already there's a whole lot riding on the role of a data privacy officer we have a lot to unpack here so let's get into it now you want to ask yourself who is a data privacy officer first of all let's understand who a data privacy professional is data privacy professionals are experts who specialize in protecting sensitive and personal information from unauthorized access and use okay let me repeat that data privacy professionals or data privacy officers are experts whose work basically is to protect sensitive and personal information from unauthorized access or use they help organizations implement best practices for data privacy and security they maintain compliance with privacy laws and regulations and conduct risk assessment to identify potential privacy threats. They also advise on privacy related issues. They develop privacy policies and procedures and manage data breaches. They ensure that organizations are taking necessary measures to secure their data and protect the privacy of their customers and employees. It seems like a lot because it is, trust me. This role is a very crucial one due to the increasing importance of protecting individuals privacy and complying with data protection laws and regulations with cyber criminals always looking for vulnerabilities to exploit organizations can be too careful trust me now the roles and responsibilities of a data privacy officer as a data privacy professional you will ensure the protection of sensitive data and adherence to regulations such as GDPR, Personal Information Protection and Electronic Documentation Act, PAPIDA, Children's Online Privacy Protection Act, COPA, Health Insurance Portability and Accounting Act, HIPAA, Consumer Data Protection Act, CDPA, and Digital Services Act, DSA, to maintain privacy and security. With the increasing demand for data protection, a career in this field offers stability, growth, and job security. I will be real with you. Data protection is a round-the-clock task. Okay, A data privacy officer navigates through a sea of personal data daily, like every day, ensuring that it's handled ethically and legally. Of course, these tasks play a very vital role in the overall security structure of any organization. So someone has to do it and you will build a guy right because you want to make the money okay now what are the necessary skills and qualifications to succeed in this role a strong grounding in cyber security and data protection laws is essential i made reference to earlier based on the roles and responsibilities of a data privacy officer you will need an in-depth understanding of relevant data protection laws and regulations such as gdpr ccpa HIPAA. A data privacy officer has to be well versed in various privacy frameworks and have a keen eye for detail. Most people who start a career in this role come from a background in law, IT or cyber security. Okay? Certifications such as CIPP or CIPT can give you a great advantage. For skills, you will need strong communication skills to explain complex privacy concepts to both technical and non-technical stakeholders. Then, you also need privacy management skills, technical acumen, organizational skills, and a few other similar skills. In this role as well, 
an analytical and ethical mind comes in very handy okay now here is the thing embarking on the path to becoming a data privacy officer is a huge responsibility so it helps if you have experience in roles related to cyber security legal compliance or data management already working in positions like compliance officer or cyber security analyst can help lay a solid foundation for you the next thing you would want to do here is pursue certifications relevant to data privacy such as CISSP, right? Develop a comprehensive understanding of data protection laws and regulations with a focus on the regions or industries in which you plan to work. If yours is Europe, you know that is strictly GDPR. And if the only industry you want to work is health, you know that is HIPAA. Very importantly, you will need to hone your technical skills in IT and security, as DPOs often need to work closely with IT teams to implement privacy measures and assess security protocols. Also, you need to stay updated with the latest development in data protection laws and cyber security threats as this will be a lifesaver here. And of course, networking and continuous learning. Through workshops and seminars, you can significantly impact career progression as well. Now let's look at the career growth and opportunities as a DPO and you know in my usual manner I save the best for the last let's talk salary career progression and opportunities we all know that digital privacy is a huge deal these days nobody wants their personal business out in the open most especially organizations that have access to sensitive data okay now in a bid to ensure private details remain private organizations are willing to pay as much as $194,000 for skilled professionals. With some years of experience, you can progress to senior leadership roles in privacy and data governance, or branch into consultancy or policy development and go on to enjoy a rewarding career. The opportunities in this role are such that you will have a rewarding career, continuous career development, and a chance to establish yourself as a leader in the data privacy field i hate to say this but we've come to the end of our guide to becoming a data privacy officer in cyber security but not to worry we'll be bringing you more videos like this one so i will see you on the next one and if you got this far don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel drop any questions or your own experience in the comments thank you for watching Check out our other videos for more insights into cyber's radio roles and trends. Stay ahead in the rapidly evolving world of digital privacy. See you on the next one. Bye for now.